Hey, welcome back to Clean Cut, where we can talk about the truth about just about anything, as long as we use logic and common sense. This season we're talking about prayers, and this time we'll talk about the prayers for mealtimes. Now, of course, these are only prayers commonly used before and after meals. While it's customary to pray in mealtime and thank God for his gifts, you don't need to use these specific prayers, and even if you use these prayers, there's no reason not to use others as well. I take the mealtime opportunity to pray for a number of different intentions as well, so it's not as though this is some kind of hard and fast rule. That said, here's the prayer before meals. Bless us, O Lord. A simple start, addressing God and asking Him to give us His blessings. And these thy gifts. We acknowledge that the meal before us is a gift from God, and ask for it to be blessed as well, which we are about to receive from thy bounty. Receive, in this case, means eat or consume. The gifts themselves come to us, first off, from the great riches that God has to offer us. Through Christ our Lord. Amen. As with all of the things that God gives us, it's ultimately through the Son of God that God grants them to us. Now the prayer for after a meal is finished. We give thee thanks for all thy benefits, O Almighty God. Again, a simple start, thanking God for the things that he gives us, which benefit us, and acknowledging his great power. Who livest and reignest, world without end. Amen. We acknowledge that God lives and reigns forever. May the souls of the faithful departed, through the mercy of God, rest in peace. Amen. Finally, an additional intention, of the same type seen at the end of the eternal rest, praying that those who die, remaining faithful to God, will be admitted into heaven by God's mercy. Next time, can we offer any prayers to guardian angels? That's all for now, so keep asking questions, and thanks for watching.